Hey guys, and welcome to part two of The Sims 4 Let's Play. E so exciting. All right, so where we left off, we pretty much just um, changed up Peyton's look a little bit because we kind of had to because of some custom content problems. But um, yeah, and then we had her move into this house, and now we're looking at styled rooms. So styled rooms gives you a choice of pre-designed rooms like kitchens or bathrooms. You can also build new rooms from here. Okay, so that's styled rooms. Magazine view. These buttons let you look at different room sorts. Okay, so like um, dining rooms. Click the image to see an expanded version and then click individual items to purchase or select buy the room. Oh, wow. This is so neat. <gasps> oh, and you can just pick it up. You can just buy... Oh. <laughs> you can also build new rooms from scratch. Oh, no. This is where... I've never been a very good builder, so I'm hoping with The Sims 4 that will change, and I'll like to build more. Um, you can place entire rooms in a variety of shapes or build an individual wall. Click a wall. Click a room or wall tool. Okay. Click a room to see your options with it. You can move it. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> That's so strange. Okay. You move it with the arrows. After you place a room, you can add a foundation. Okay, was I supposed to add a foundation? I'm sorry, guys. I wasn't paying attention to your tutorial. Once you add a foundation, you can raise or lower its height. Okay. So, oh, okay, I just did it. <laughs> I just did it. Wow, I'm going to be such a noob in this video. So, there. You can raise them super high or bring them down a bit. We'll keep it like that because I'm wasting her money. <laughs> Navigate the build menu by clicking on the portion of the house you want to build. Oh, cool. Okay, so like roof. And it brings you to all the roofs. That's super cool. And then they have fences, doors, everything. Oh, wow. Okay. This is so cool. You can even search it right here. All right. So how do you, this is the sledgehammer. So you can just delete like that. Alrighty guys. So I am playing along, at, like I said, my first time playing. So you go ahead and you go to the options menu and you go to game options and then you can go to controls and camera. And you could switch to the Sims 3 camera. So um, it, you can use the middle mouse button to to um, like control the pitch and stuff. And it's just a lot easier for me to actually play the game now. And I feel so much better. I feel so much better I have my old controls back. Yes. Okay, now I feel like I can really play the game. <laughs> Alright, so we want to go ahead and go into build mode. Um, so there are some powerful and easy tools. Let's see my few of them now. The eyedropper tool. So you can quickly copy an item like a chair, light fixture. Alrighty. We knew that. The sledgehammer tool. We knew that. Design tool to click on any household item and quickly change its color and pattern a la Sims 2. Undo and redo. We know those buttons. Rotate held objects. If you're holding an item on your cursor, you can rotate it by tapping the period or comma keys. Okay. That's neat. This is the lot info panel. Save to library. Move whole house. Uh, and you can change it from morning, afternoon, evening, and night. But we'll keep it morning for now. Okay. So where to start? She has, wow, she doesn't even have a fridge or toilet or nothing. I didn't know that. I did not know that was going to happen. So, <laughs> sorry. Um, let's go ahead and see what we can do. Uh, they have top down view as well, which is nice. Um, page up, page down. Um, walls cut away. I don't need to see those now. Alrighty. So let's go ahead and what do I want to look at? Do you guys want to see the objects that came with Digital Deluxe? Let's go ahead and see. So 
these are the lights that you can, <laughs> these are the special lights that you can get for owning The Sims 3 games. Um, so you get like these plumb bob lights in your game for each expansion pack and everything. Um, so yeah. Let there be light laser show. So life is always a party with an instant on laser light show that's glowing with surprises. Light up the night with special animations featuring the Freezer Bunny or Grim Reaper. So this is a laser light show that came with it, which we'll have to definitely look at um, when the time comes. All right, we got some, we got a yin yang rug <laughs> and some sculptures like this one that came once again for owning all the Sims 3 games. Uh, this is the Tiki Bar, uh, wall decorations, balloons, streamers, wall decorations. That's really cool. Table, chairs, eee. Okay. Hmm. What do I want to do first? We'll go to the kitchen. That sounds easy. <laughs> We'll go to the kitchen. Okay. And we will click on the refrigerator. They have quite a bit of stuff here. Um, this one can be unlocked by reaching level eight of the culinary career. Well, that's cool. All right. Well, we have $9,000, so I really don't want to be spending too much money. Um, I guess we're going to have to get a crappy fridge. Uh, we could get gray. Green, blue, black. <laughs> we'll just go ahead and get a white fridge for now. All right, we'll go to counters. Once again, a lot of options. Um, ooh, she can have a purple counter. <laughs> no, we'll do... We'll do this one, I guess. Okay. Like that. I don't know. All right, stoves. Let's see. I like this one. We'll get this one. Um, here, we'll add some more. This whole setup takes a lot of getting used to, guys. Like, I don't know. It's just kind of weird. But we'll get used to it, I'm sure. That's her little kitchen. <laughs> Alrighty, and then we'll go to, uh, what else haven't we done? They have miscellaneous decorations, alarms, we should probably get that, but sinks. We'll get the cheapest sink here. We'll put it right there. And she probably needs some lighting, huh? I'm thinking yes, so... This is a wall light. Like that. Not very bright. Um, this is kind of a nice light. I like this one. Oh my gosh, her house. <laughs> I will get better at this over time, guys. Trust me. All right. So that's her little kitchen. <laughs> this is her kitchen. And let's go ahead and look at living room stuff, maybe. Where is it? Living room. All right. Oh, garden friend. She can have a little bunny thing or a pig. I love pigs. They're so cute. I do. I love pigs. Okay. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and put these walls up again so I can kind of kind of see what I'm doing here. All right. So... Hmm. It's kind of an odd setup here. Let's go ahead and... Can we delete this wall? Okay. Do they have half walls? I would think they would. But maybe not. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Flat square. Wall tool. That doesn't look like... You can do half walls. Unless I'm missing something. That's a little odd. Well, I guess we'll keep that wall there. Uh, 
Alrighty, I guess we'll keep that there, even though I don't really want it there, but, um, let's see, what else can we do? Uh, go back to this, get a sofa, cheap sofa. <laughs> uh, we'll change the color. We'll make it black. And where can we put it? Where it will look decent. Hmm. So if you hold down the alt key, you can pretty much move it anywhere you want, which is kind of cool. Um, but we're going to go ahead and put it where is the delete button? Sell. There we go. Okay. Wow. I'm telling you, this is like a really, it's honestly like a totally different game to me because like, everything is just so different. Um, but it's not a bad thing. I'm just saying it's very, very different. Okay. So let's go ahead and find TV. The penguin TV. She's totally going to have this penguin TV, you guys, because you know what? She doesn't have that much money and I don't want her power to get shut off, but actually I kind of do want her power to get shut off. I think that'd be really cool. Um, <laughs> fireplace oh girl i wish i wish but i don't think right now is a good idea to do that let's go ahead and get her coffee table oh my gosh <laughs> she can't see her penguin tv over the coffee table oh my word oh so they actually have tv stands that is really, really neat. I like that a lot. Let's go ahead and put that up there. <laughs> Gorgeous house so far. Top notch, guys. But like, she's just going to start out in this starter home, but she will move up and I will build them. I'll take the time to really build them a super nice house over time. So don't, don't worry about that. I'm going to build a nice house for them. Them. She hasn't even met her husband future husband yet but yeah they will have a nice house i swear so let's go ahead and give her oh i have a lamp that kind of looks like this go ahead and give her that one. <laughs> oh gosh <laughs> it's not the best house but what can you do guys so end tables a crate i don't think so give her this one this house is so ugly, guys. It really is. I know. I know. Believe me. This is like the ugliest house ever. But I am still getting used to it all. All right. So what can we... What does she need now? Oh, a table and chairs, maybe, for eating. Let's go ahead and go to the dining room. There we go. All right. So tables. Um, she doesn't need a super big table. I mean, it is just her. So let's go ahead and give her this simple one and some chairs. that all right okay that's good um can we get like a rug um sort by function maybe uh let's see decorations rugs okay i'm getting the hang of this guys i'm getting the hang of it i know i'm a noob what can i say I'm a noob. All right. So I just want something. I want something circular that will look cool. Like that does not look cool. <laughs> that does not look cool at all. <laughs> oh, this is a really cute rug. I like that rug a lot. Wow. They have some nice, some nice stuff. They really do guys. Um, let's see. That will work for now. Like I said, I'm going to build them a super nice house and I'm super excited to make it too. I cannot wait. I'm going to really put a lot of effort into it. <laughs> so uh, I hope you guys will stick around for that because I promise it will not be this, this ugly. I feel like if we just change the color of some stuff, it might look a little bit better. Like white. No. Black. White. 
So that, I think that looks a little bit better. If I do say so myself, okay? If I do say so myself. Ooh, the black table looks really nice. Maybe some white chairs. And the rug. Uh, we'll keep the rug like that. <laughs> um, Alright, so then we have... Mirrors, curtains, lighting. All right. Do we have ceiling lights? Yes, we do. All right. I'm getting the hang of where stuff is. I'm proud of myself. I have not, I've literally not seen anything of build mode for myself yet. So it's kind of confusing. All right. Let's get them. Let's just get her this one for now. Something simple. And yeah, like I said, it's not really nothing, nothing super fancy right now, but. Ooh, you can move it up and down the wall. That's nice. It's very tactile and intuitive. Yes. Um, okay, so what's next? I think bathroom is probably more the most important thing next. That's probably the most important step, I would say, anyways. So let's go ahead and try to find the bathroom. <laughs> if I can. If I can manage that. Um, Alright, once again, we're going to go for cheap, 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 cheap toilet. And shower, tub, we'll get her a shower. Uh, right there. I guess that works. Um, she probably needs a sink too. Or can we put it across? Hmm. Where should we put stuff, guys? I don't know. That's good. That's good. We'll get her a mirror. Alright. <laughs> really not pretty at all. Really, really not. Not at all. Alright. Get her some more lighting. And then we'll just finish off her bedroom. So let's go ahead to bedroom. Oh, wow. Okay. So, do we want a spring for the $430 double bed, or should we give her something really super cheap and just make her deal with it? I don't know. I think we're going to go ahead and give her a double bed, just because, you know. You know. Okay. So, let's go ahead and get her a bed. Awesome. Awesome. All right. And then we'll design it. Ooh, they have some nice bedspreads here. Let's see which one screams Peyton. I kind of like that one. I like this one too. We're going to give her this one. Um, and a dresser. Cool. Uh, just give her, um, hmm. Give her this one for now. See if she'll be able to walk around that. I don't know if she'll be able to or not. We'll see. We'll see. Alright. What else does a bedroom need? Some end tables, maybe? We'll make them black this time. And another one. Cool. All right. And I feel like she needs some kind of painting or something. So let's go ahead and try to find her some cute. Wow. They have a lot of paintings in the base game. Can you imagine what the expansion packs are going to have in the stuff packs? Like, yeah, it's going to be a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff. All right. So I'm not sure exactly what I want her to have, but. Ooh, this is nice. I like this. I like that. I like it. I like it a lot. All right. Maybe something else. I like too? this one. It's kind of creepy. Like really kind of creepy. Let's be honest, but I kind of like it. So, <laughs> all right. And then she needs some lighting for her room, of course. So let's go ahead back to function lighting table lamps. That will work. Uh, where are table lamps right here? Table lamps. Alrighty. So 
wow they have a lot of cute stuff for like little kids like oh a panda lamp that is so cute i can't wait till she has kids i cannot wait Ooh, these candles though super pretty um uh, but then we should get her like some kind of real lighting here um I don't know, we'll just give her, like, this... <laughs> Nothing matches at all, guys. Like, really does not match. At all. That'll work. Her beautiful bedroom. I'm just so happy. Um, <laughs> let's go ahead and look at some decorations. Maybe, like, some um, miscellaneous decorations. Like, little stuff. Okay. So they have this like little towel rack, which is awesome. Make it a little more homey. Yes. Uh, what else? A laundry basket. That is really neat. I like that a lot. <laughs> I'm going to be adding all kinds of extra crap and use up all her money. Oh. Shower stuff. <laughs> Scented candles. She already has candles on her nightstand so uh let's go ahead and give her a towel to dry off her hands i guess that'll work <laughs> uh medicine cabinet yes that's a medicine cabinet uh what else a bath cabinet kind of add takes up some extra space here maybe we'll get rid of the uh laundry basket and put this in instead yeah. All right. What else can we do, guys? Let's see. Should we have a partition in her room? <laughs> oh, she could have a fruit basket. Let's get her a fruit basket. And <laughs> let's see. Ooh, pot rack up here. Oh, yeah. That adds a lot to it. To the room. Nice. Alright. Alright, so is there any other little things that we could put on her... Ooh, clutter. There we go. <laughs> clutter. Alright, so we could give her... Some... Pile of laundry. Should we get a pile of laundry? It's $50, guys. $50 to put a pile of laundry on your floor. But we'll do it. Make it look a little more lived in, I guess. <laughs> and... What else? Ooh, nail polish. I love that. Yes, I wish they could actually paint their nails. That'd be really cool, though. Um, ooh, perfume. And what else is there? Shoe rack. <laughs> she doesn't even have the money for a shoe rack. Okay. Ladies perfume. And something else. One more thing. What can we get? add? We will give her a couple of books to read at night. Okay. Um. <laughs> Alright, so this is that's her house, guys. Aren't you impressed? I bet you are. I bet you're just like, wow, Whitney, this house, this house should be, I should upload this to the gallery, shouldn't I? Because this house is just so, so beautiful. <laughs> All right, guys. So now that I kind of took you guys through the build by mode, I am going to go ahead and end this part, but don't worry because I have another part coming. <laughs> I'm going on a recording spree because I really want to play. So in the next part, we will get into gameplay, which I know you guys is, that's what you guys really want to see. So if you like this part, go ahead, give it a like, comment, and subscribe for more, and I will see you guys in the next part. Bye.